Ready? Ready. Still ready? Yeah, ready. Let's go. Hi everybody, welcome to Big Oggy World and welcome to It's Cocktail Corner. Yeah. With the, with the sign, Cocktail Corner. But it might not be on a Friday because right now we're running different videos every single day all the way to run up to Christmas. That's what yeah? we're planning. We are not dressed in the same clothes we're always filming in. This just happens to be that we've made four different recipes today so far. Yeah. We've got a golden pudding happening behind us. Steaming. Steaming. We've got some beautiful stuffing over there, alternative Christmas stuffing with pears and chestnuts in it. It's yeah. lovely. And we've got a panettone blend butter pudding going on in the oven. We have. You are knackered. I am absolutely done. I've had it. Um, so I'm going to make you a cocktail. Right. You may not like this one, but it will certainly revive you. Okay. Well, or, or, right. or leave you up your sleep. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to make a Manhattan. Okay. Okay. Um, people who know about cocktails will say that we should be using rye whiskey, but rye whiskey is quite spicy, and that's why they like it. I tend to like bourbon, which is slightly different, but you can eat your own. Okay. Okay. So we're using bourbon. Basically, it's a two to one in measurement. So it's bourbon, red vermouth. We've got Cinzano, but Martinez, all the other ones around couple of dashes of Angostura bitters and a bit of cocktail cherry and okay. that's it okay no right. mi no melting it down no watering it down nothing okay okay so I'm using Maker's Mark bourbon because uh, in honor of my brother Larry who passed away a few years ago and um, I found out he really liked this particular brand and uh, when he came back from Australia there's, there's a long story about how we've not seen each other very often in our lives but when he came back from Australia and I was quite young I was getting into bourbon and whiskey and I found out he drank the same one he actually brought one back with him on a duty free, so that's how I know. So, a plus it's all scarf, fantastic. Oh, look, beautiful little jumper for Christmas. We got we collect teddy bears. We put that on a teddy bear, can't we? Yeah, but you just bought yourself a morph. I think that would fit. Really I fit it on, fit it on morph. Yeah. Um, if you may have seen that video already when I was in Bristol the other day doing a vegan burger, so I went to a morph experience. Right. Okay. So we're going to get this done very quickly because we got things in the oven. We've got to get sorted. So we're going to get a glass. Turn off, you're going to turn off that dishwasher? There we go. I thought it had an audience. So, in this glass, we've got a cocktail cherry in a stick because this is your glass it's going to end up in. This is our cooling glass. We don't own a cooling glass. They're quite a fancy little glass with a lip on them. They're designed to cool down drinks without watering them down. Right. Like a shaker, but we're not shaking stuff, we're stirring. So, into this, you want a double dose of this, so 50 millilitres of the bourbon or your rye whiskey, whichever you're using. Pretty sure there are other combinations of this where you use brandy, different things, but we're doing a sweet, sorry, a sweet Manhattan. Okay. So that's that one. 25 millilitres of the red vermouth. Now we could have turned this up the other way, but we don't want to make a mess, do we love? We don't make a mess in this world, do we? Saying nothing. Watch the blooper video. That's be coming out in Christmas. That one, right. well done. Couple of dashes of Angostura bitters, which is a kind of an orangey thing. Need a few of those actually. That'll be fine. One, two, three. Well, a few will do, four, right? Five. That'll be fine. Right. And a bit of this stuff you Yeah, said. we need a, a little bit of the actual syrup from the cocktail cherry jar. There are various cocktail cherry jars around, but we've just got this one because it's what we can find fine in the enough. shops. It's fine. That's okay. So, in that, we'd also put a little twist of lemon. Do that in there. Oh, you want to be pretty. Go on then. Stir that up. And the whole point about this is stirring it up so this chills down. Because you're not going to water down the drink by putting it in there. Now, we've already kind of done one of these earlier, did we not? Um, and we know it's not going to fit in that glass. It's going to... This so do you want to make a bigger one? Or are you happy with what we got? Well, you don't think I'm going to like it. So I don't. So we'll, we'll leave it there. Double one. Oh, I may have already drank a double one. Um, no, I mean like a double, double one. I may not be able to drink six. We'll see. Okay, let's put this in and we'll see what happens. So, would you like to do the stirring bit? Then? I will do the honours this time. There, that was so much cleaner, wasn't it? Yes, it so was. So much less stressful without trying to chase items. But we're not going to say too much, okay? But we are going to try and put a little blooper video together for round right about Christmas Eve. Is we'll that, see what we can do. That's ready, then, is it? Uh, that's ready. You may drink that. Good luck. Of oh, course, pretty potent. It is. Mm. 
You're not a whiskey fan, you see. Do you know that's not bad though? Well, it's not because you get the, because the sweetness that I've removed kind of takes that real burn away, but you do get the burn. There is a burn. And then the cherry, it's the cherry. It's, it's, the, it's the syrup from the cherry that just kind of gives it this oh, strange flavour. So, what do you think? It's not bad. Good, isn't it? I could sip one of them. And fall over, probably. I you probably would... would put a cube of ice in it, though. Just You're not supposed to do that. Yeah, I know fine. you're not supposed to, but I probably would. Or you can knock it back really quickly and start another one like we had to do. No. That's but not bad. Very good. Thanks for watching, watching, everybody. Please subscribe, please hit the notification bell, do all those things. Come and join us on Big Oggy World, me on Big Oggy Golf and follow our journey all the way through to Christmas. But that's a nice one. I'll get me panatonia out though. Go get your panatonia out, love. Bye everybody. Big soon. Bye for now.